So the four trumpets have to be released first, and the carnage from that, where 25% of the Earth, Earth's population is killed, after about two months of this, this is when Babylon will be formed. Well, let's turn at our study of the Great Tribulation down to reference point number five. So it's right here on our uh, little sketch here of the last uh, days, the, the Great Tribulation. The global disasters and the carnage that follows the release of the first four trumpets will be overwhelming and, it, and they will overwhelm the governments of the world. They will not have any solutions for these problems. They're going to be so uh, great that the governments won't know what to do. So out of desperation, they will turn to the major religions on earth for help to appease what they perceive to be an angry God. And they will ask, how can we stop God from totally destroying the earth? So here we find in Revelation 13, 1, that the major religions will form an alliance. It will be a global church-state alliance called Babylon in the Bible. Now, if you notice on our timeline, I hope you look at, to download this from the link at the bottom in the comments area, little PDF file. You can print it out at your own uh, home. Number five here starts a little bit delayed from the initial release of the four trumpets. So the four trumpets have to be released first, and the carnage from that, where 25% of the Earth, Earth's population is killed. After about two months of this, this is when Babylon will be formed, and they'll call on the religions of the world to help appease God to stop this carnage. So this uh, religious alliance will recommend to the governments around the world laws that will force people to be more, quote, religious, to sin less. And so each of the recommendations that each one of the religious groups will offer will be according to their unique beliefs of, of the various faiths. So there won't be one global uh, mandate to do a certain thing. Different countries, different regions, different cultures around the world will have different uh, laws enacted to appease God as they determine it. So the, each country will then enact their God's version, if you will, of strict religious and moral laws to force compliance to what they consider as sinless con conduct in their country. Now, you can use your own imagination as to what different religions around the world considers uh, moral laws in their country. That's quite different, isn't it? But these, will, well, these are the type of laws that will be enacted. And in the Revelation 13, verse 5, we read, and there was given unto him a mouth speaking great things and blasphemies, and power was given to him to continue forty and two months. So, who is the him we're talking about here? Him is Babylon. Babylon is the church uh, state alliance. The seven headed beast in Revelation 13 1 is given. 42 months to speak blasphemies and power is given to this beast by God. God is the one that's allowing this to happen. And he will, he will uh, speak blasphemous things for 42 months. So the religious beast in Revelation 13 verse 1 will last for exactly 1,241 days before it collapses during the seven last plagues.